what resonated with me personally, um, and I was reading, of course, looking at the character that I would potentially be playing, Elizabeth Turner, who was Nat Turner's slave owner um, at, the, at the time. And, and I think what, what I found fascinating about it was, you know, here was a woman who was really ahead of her time in terms of um, the fact that my character teaches Nat, um, this slave boy, to read, um, which in those days was not only unheard of, but it was illegal. I felt very honored that that Nate chose me, and I felt that one of the great things about working with Nate was just how precise and decisive he was about everything, and that's, I think, what makes him so incredibly talented as a director and a filmmaker, and um, just because he just knows what he wants, and when he wants it, he, he just goes after it, and he gets it, and it kind of, I mean, and you can just see by the fact that he even got this movie off the ground. Um, even if it took seven years. I mean, it was a passion project and he just went after it and it was so impressive what he's done. Um, and I, I just feel like he wanted to surround himself with people that I guess he felt some sort of an emotional connection with and, um, and we kind of had that right off the bat and I think he felt so connected to Elizabeth, you know, because she was such a maternal figure to Nat. Um, and and I do, I mean, you look at Asia Naomi King and Gabrielle Union and all these incredible actors, no matter, you know, how big or small the roles, you know, are in the film, you know, everybody has such an important role and everybody means so much. You know, every piece is, is just so important to this movie. And I feel like, you know, part of, I think, what made his mother, I mean, you know, I, I just... You know, even even she is 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 remarkable because I felt like, you know, the, those the, the, those women are really what formed also who Nat was. You know, I think those relationships are really kind of are the part of the fabric of what made Nat Turner, you know, who he was as a man. Were these women who supported him, so who surrounded him, who you know, Ingenue Ellis, who's like, who played his mother. She's incredible and. You know, I just sort of feel like everybody kind of like, you know, really all had a had a purpose and um, and were they were they were strong and they were independent. They were kind of fierce and they were very, um, in spite of their circumstances and in spite of the like I said before, in spite of their lack of freedom and, and oppression and restrictions. You know, they still there was some fire in them that went beyond um, what they were able to to really perhaps want to do. Um, so they sort of instilled something in him in an interesting way.